This is the filling port. This is the withdrawal port and it is controlled by the hand wheel. This is the fixed level gauge and this is the vapor withdrawal port. There are four machined holes in this valve. The first hole is for liquid withdrawal. It is connected to the liquid withdrawal port. The second hole is for fixed level tube and it is connected to the fixed level port. The third hole is for liquid filling and it is connected to the filling port. And the fourth port is for vapor withdrawal which is connected to the withdrawal port. This is the EFCV or excess flow check valve. The following are the fittings. Actuator, quick release coupling, grub screw M6, washer, gasket, chuck nut, nut M6, and handle. The following are the toolings that would be required in mounting the actuator. Actuator tightening key, Allen key 3 mm, spanner E10, chuck nut spanner and torque wrench of minimum 35 nm. Before mounting the combo valve on the cylinder, apply thread sealant. The recommended thread sealant for combo valve is Everseal 183. Apply a uniform coating of Everseal 183 and let the valve dry for 24 hours for proper curing. Now we will show you how to mount the actuator and QCC onto the combo valve. First we will see how to mount the actuator. Place the chuck nut on the combo valve withdrawal port. Now place the gasket in the actuator and mount the actuator on the combo valve. Tighten the actuator using actuator tightening key and torque wrench. Set torque wrench to 40 nm and tighten the actuator. Tighten the actuator up to 40 nm. Now, using the chuck nut spanner, tighten the chuck nut to lock the actuator in a fixed position. Apply thread sealant on grub screw and mount it on the actuator. Tighten it using 3mm Allen key. Place the handle washer in the grub screw and mount the handle on the actuator. Use M6 nut and tighten it properly. Use E10 spanner for tightening M6 nut. Now mount the quick release coupling on the actuator. Now the complete fitting is mounted on the withdrawal port of the combo valve. Check the thread leakage of mounting at 8 kg per centimeter square pressure.
The BCPL valve has two pins, which means it is repairable and it ensures equal load distribution. The BCPL valve uses a circular ergonomically designed plug. Each combo valve has a laser marked batch number as well as an individual serial number. The BCPL combo valve is fitted with an excess flow check valve. Thank you for watching and always remember to use PESO approved valves only.